Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to talk to you about um, top later sellers. Top rated seller status. What happened to me last year? Um, I kind of became a rebel with eBay. Um, I started doing things opposite to what they expect you to do. So, for example, um, as soon as I realized I've lost my top rated status, I deliberately started doing things reverse, meaning eBay wants you to deliver product one one day handling, two days handling, things like that, and they that sort of thing. They just push you and push you to do these things. And I did the opposite. Instead of one day delivery, I've uh, postage and packaging one day delivery. What I've done, I put three days delivery on my listing. And so I lost my status, um, top rated status in 2017. So I started doing everything opposite. See how they go on. I'm trying to sort of like um, test the waters per se. So People tend to, uh, I've watched a lot of YouTube videos on eBay sellers telling, oh, you have to do this, you have to do that. And I thought, no, 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 I'm going to do totally opposite. So, people go and bang on about your listing not being in top and this and that, and eBay is going to dump your listing. Who on earth, who tells you this nonsense? Right, basically what you can what I've done I play the game differently so if you think your listing is going to be a right bottom because you're not top rated and all this nonsense what you have to do is use a bit of a sense common sense for example look now if you go in the seller's hub for example you have all your all the every tools you need to use this so you know to bypass this all you need to do is use eBay start marketing your product on eBay start promoting list promoting promote your listing you know, if you start promoting your listing for example you are paying eBay to promote your listing for you so so do you think eBay whether you have whether you are top rated seller or not top rated seller because you are paying the money to promote your product they're going to promote it so your listing will be on top of other people's listing so you are manipulating them they want you to do that even though they tell you, yeah, become a top rated seller, yeah, do this, do that. But I'm using them, yeah, because in any business, if you're running an offline business, you have to promote your shops or services. How do you promote it? You have to use Google AdWords, you have to use advertising, you have to use other forms, the social media to promote your listing or whatever you're selling. So... If you're using eBay to move all your stuff, there's no need for you to worry whether you are a top-rated eBay seller or not, because they're going to put up your listing anyway. So I did that. So I put my listing on three days. Three days listing. Sorry, three days PNP, post and packaging. And behold, nothing's happened. Everything stays the same. Right. Come a couple of months later in 2018, suddenly I just discovered I've became, I've all, they turned me back to top rated seller. 
So let's go to my hub and find out. Um, over, let's go to overview. And let's have a look where we are. Where is the uh, second? So about this. Let's Right. Um, okay, um, I'm trying to figure out what is all right. Okay, right, here we are. Now what they have done in 2000, start of 2018, they put me back to eBay to upgrade your seller again. I was a bit surprised. But honestly, I don't think I have done any hard work to achieve that. And they just put me up again eBay to operate a seller. And even if they take it back again, I don't really care. You know, I know what I'm doing and I know the feedback I'm going from the customers and things are going well. You know, last, in start of 2018, I had a few issues. I did not do well selling on eBay. So even though uh, with all that in mind, I'm still, they still decided I'm good enough to be eBay top rated seller. So, which is kind of good for me. Um, if we go to my feedback, I'm still getting great feedback from people. So, which is really, really good. Even though I'm on my all of my listing, you will state three days um, post and packaging handling. And even though I told people that I'll send them within three working days, but well, I'll send them obviously I send them straight away. So that way they still I still get a great feedback. Look, this is one here. Good price, fast delivery, many thanks. Really fast deliveries, everything just described. Great eBay item, lovely. Good quality item, described, helpful seller, blah, blah, blah. It goes on and on. And I would like to thank everyone who is purchasing stuff of me and buying things and leaving all these lovely comments. Thank you so much. And I hope you guys, when you watch this video, it will encourage you. You don't have to, If you, even if you lose your eBay status, don't think it's end of the world. It's, it does not really matter. All you need to do is keep on doing the good work. Keep on providing the good service to your customers. And they will come back. Even though if you tell them three days handling and shipping, make sure you push them in within the first day of when, you, when, you, um, when your item sells. So that's the way to go. And if you want to boost your um, sales and your items selling on eBay or obviously use their platform to do the advertising campaigns you know use use eBay to promote your listing and do all kind of stuff so even if you have social media you know advertise put a go on Banging the drums, you know, that will help. So, I hope this little video has encouraged somebody. Thank you so much. If you like it, please click subscribe and like button. And thank you so much for watching.